Hey everyone, today I'm doing a review for you on the Gourmia Meat Slicer. I have the 9 inch one and this is um, perfect for doing meats. You can do cheeses. Um, just trying to give you a quick show here of it. You have a stainless steel blade and it is a cast aluminum construction and you have your sliding part here which is what you're going to put your meat on um, to do it and then you've got your on off switch over here and then over here is where you adjust the thickness of your meat that you're going to be slicing. So the one thing I did um, really like so far about this is it has grippers. So this is suctioned to the table. You're not going to have issues with it sliding. So you want to make sure the gripper feet are securely gripped to your flat surface that you're going to be uh, slicing your meat on. The piece here turns clockwise to unscrew and release the blade for washing, which I've already washed it prior to using. And then there's three little gear holes that it fits back into and then you turn it counterclockwise until it is completely locked into position. And your blade is stainless steel. It is marked on it. If you can see there, it says stainless steel. So I am going to go ahead and slice up a little bit of ham here real quick for you and I will be um, back to show you that. Okay, so um, I'm just going to do a few slices of ham here for you. I got it all set up. Um, just going to turn it on. It's not very noisy or anything, um, but obviously it does have a motor. So, turn it on. And I have my plate set. And then I have my ham sliced. I used to work in a deli, so I'm kind of familiar with slicing um, meat. But you can adjust it to whatever thickness you want. So that's what we like to have for our sandwiches. And my ham is boneless. You always want to make sure you have boneless meat when you're doing this. And you actually have your food guard here, but my ham piece is a little too big. So I'm just being careful in slicing it until it gets a little bit lower without it. But um, after I slice a little bit more for sandwiches, I'm just going to change my thickness and I'm going to slice up a few ham steaks and we are going to be good to go. To clean it, um, you remove the blade, wash the blade in warm soapy water, rinse it and dry it. Um, this piece here does lift down like so and it will come off. Um, the instruction book does show you, so you can remove this. And so this is kind of a nice feature, too. And there you have it. Again, this is the Gourmet Slicer, and this is the one with the 9-inch blade. Thanks for watching.